In this video we will be creating a new user for our Linux system and then we will be granting sudo privileges to it. To create a new user open your terminal and access the system with root or any other user that has sudo privileges and then type add user and then the username that you want to give it. I just call it arashtag. Please note that I'm logged in as root, so I don't need to type sudo before the command. But if you're using another user, you need to type sudo, add user, and then username. Press enter, and you'll be asked for password. Give it a strong password. Press enter, and we type the password. Note that the password you type is not shown here and that's only because of the security reasons otherwise the terminal is working and the password is entered. After that press enter and if you will you can add some more information about this user otherwise simply press enter and finalize the process. And your user is created now. To grant sudo privileges to this user we can type user mod and then dash a capital G and then sudo and at the end the username by pressing enter this user will be granted with sudo privileges also to test the process you can log into this user by typing su and then username and here we can type who am I and it will return username at the beginning but by doing sudo who am I it must return root enter the password and press enter and it means that the user has sudo privileges the other way of granting sudo privilege to a user is typing vsudo and opening this document going to the bottom of the document and add this line username and then all in capital letters equals all colon all and another all in capital letters saving this document with this line of code will grant privileges to this specific user as well just like what we did with the command line this is the way we can create a user and grant the privileges and whenever you want to log in to a user you can type su dash and then the username just like this and when you want to log out just type log out just like this hope this helped Stay tuned for more Linux tutorials and take care.